Hello everyone and welcome to 10 extinct dog breeds we'd love to meet. It's likely that you don't give their dog family tree much thought when you envision your favorite canines, such as the affectionate American Pit Bull Terrier, the Spirited Beagle, or the Sunny Golden Retriever. Like people, these cherished breeds have a distinct history and originated someplace. Regrettably, some dog breeds are extinct, including distant progenitors of our beloved modern canines. They vanished for a variety of reasons, including natural evolution, sickness, and conflict. These 10 amazing, but now extinct canine breeds are ones we would love to meet. Number 10. Talbot Hound. Originating in literature, art, and tapestries from the Middle Ages, the Talbot Hound was prized for its hunting prowess. It's unclear though, if these dogs were scent hounds, sight hounds, or quarry hounds. Talbot was more than just a breed name, it also denoted a specific hound with a distinguished appearance and noble ancestry. These stocky, short dogs had a proudly curled tail and a beautiful white coat. Originating in Normandy, they gained widespread respect in England and were commonly seen as hunting dogs and companions. Even though the purebred Talbot tragically disappeared in the late 1700s, its grandchildren, the Beagle and Bloodhound, are thought to carry on their legacy. Number 9. St. John's Water Dog. The St. John's Dog of Newfoundland is the ancestor of many modern water retrievers, such as the Labrador, Newfoundland, and curly-coated retrievers. British hunters took a keen interest in these canines, which were produced by crossing native breeds with water dogs brought over by Portuguese fishermen. In an effort to improve their capacity for fetching water, the British brought St. John's dogs to England. The breed eventually blended in perfectly with the evolution of other retriever breeds. However, evolution has lost the breed itself. Number 8. Fighting Dog of Cordoba. The Cordoba Fighting Dog, also called the Perro de Peli Cordobes or the Fighting Dog of Cordoba, is an Argentine breed. Breeders valued this powerful dog, which was tragically bred for dog fighting, for its strength, courage, and aggressive temperament in the ring. However, toward the middle of the 20th century, the general public's opinion on dog fighting changed. In a 1954 win for animal rights, the government of Argentina made dog fighting illegal. The Cordoba fighting dog population experienced a fall due to the ban and the economic conditions of the period, which ultimately resulted in the extinction of the breed. Number 7. Molossus. The Molossus, whose aggressive disposition and extraordinary hunting skills won it respect with the ancient Greeks and Romans, was said to have been brought to the Mediterranean Peninsula by the Phoenicians. On the other hand, other hypotheses propose that Alexander the Great brought these dogs to ancient Greece from conquered Asian regions. As the Molossian dogs spread to other areas, new breeds appeared to meet specific requirements and tastes. This common relative is shared by many of the most popular breeds, including the St. Bernard, Great Dane, and Bernese Mountain Dog. Number 6. Salish Wool Dog. Highly valued by the Salish Coast Native American tribes for their fur, these small, spitz-like dogs were deliberately kept apart from other village dogs to safeguard their distinctive white coat. Sheep were not raised by the Salish people of the Pacific Northwest, who are well known for their weaving skills. Rather, the tribe spun the fibers from the sheared dogs to make ritual blankets. Regrettably, colonization, the introduction of inexpensive sheep wool, and the Hudson Bay trade blankets all played a part in the woolly dog's eventual extinction. Number 5. Hawaiian Poi Dog. It was thought that the Hawaiian Poi Dog, a pot-bellied dog with a multicolored coat and a diminutive size, came to Hawaii more than a millennium ago with the Polynesians. This dog's gentle nature and affinity for kids won them over as well. Despite their amiable nature, the Hawaiian poi dog also served as a food source. The Hawaiian poi canine went extinct in the early 19th century as a result of interbreeding, most likely brought about by the introduction of other canine breeds to the region. The Honolulu Zoo's breeding effort tried to revive the extinct Polynesian pup in the 1970s. Number 4. Alpine Mastiff. One of the earliest giant-sized canines is thought to have been the huge Alpine Mastiff, which originated in northern Europe 500 BC. 
This Mastiff breed, which may have been ancestors of the English Mastiff, was capable of reaching a shoulder height of nearly 39 inches and a weight of up to 350 pounds. This breed mixed with other Molosser breeds over time. Because the Alpine Mastiff is no longer found in its pure form, the breed is currently regarded as extinct. The Saint Bernard is probably this breed's closest living relative. Number 3. Brazilian Tracker Only six years after the Brazilian Tracker's official designation by the Brazilian Kennel Club in 1967, the breed became extinct. The hunting breed's decline and eventual extinction was mostly caused by an epidemic of sickness and an overuse of pesticides. The Rastreeder Brasileiro, another name for the Brazilian tracker, was renowned for their tracking prowess. The Brazilian tracker was previously a well-liked breed in Brazil, sharing traits with the American coonhound in terms of disposition and aptitude. Through preservation breeding, attempts have recently been undertaken to revive the breed. Number 2. Argentine Polar Dog The long-haired Argentine Polar Dog breed, which was first bred by the Argentine Army for use as sled dogs in Antarctica, became extinct in 1994. The Antarctic Treaty's regulations regarding alien animals led Argentina to ban all dogs from the continent. The Army then discontinued its breeding program and moved the surviving dogs to Patagonia. Due to their isolation in Antarctica, the breed's innate resistance to a number of canine illnesses was compromised. Regretfully, the majority of deaths were brought on by illnesses. Number 1. Tezum The Tezum is an old breed with roots in ancient Egypt. This breed was highly regarded by the ancient Egyptians for its devotion and hunting skills. This famous medium-sized dog can be seen decorating the walls of tombs and temples in artwork from the era. One of the oldest known examples of the Tezum is the Khufu dog, which was found in the tomb of Pharaoh Khufu, who ruled from 2609 to 2584 BC. The Tezum, which had a sleek, muscular body, erect ears, a curled tail, and a wedge-shaped skull, later gave rise to other breeds. Two contemporary relatives of this excellent sighthound are the Saluki and the Slauhi. Highly vulnerable breeds facing extinction. Canines that would have vanished in the past are still treasured companions today because of the efforts of breed preservationists. Numerous dog breeds are still in danger of going extinct and are regarded as extremely susceptible in spite of these efforts. That's the 10 extinct dog breeds we'd love to meet. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on the bell for future notifications. And if you want to become a member then hit that join button to get some awesome emotes, perks, and much more coming soon. See you guys next time.